In the not too distant future, next Sunday, AD, there was a guy named Joel, not too different from you or me. He worked at Gizmonic Institute, just another face in a red jumpsuit. He did a good job cleaning up the place, but his boss didn't like him, so they shot him in the space. that the guys down at Aqua Brace are planning a cut and run on Conglomco Central Division. <laughs> that's what she said. Oh, <laughs> oh fun. Oh, that's great. Oh, hi, everybody. <laughs> Welcome to Saddle Love Industries. My name is Joel Robinson. I think you know my associates, Tom Servo and the Croaster. Hello. We're doing what any good marketing mad dog should first thing in the morning, hanging around the water cooler and telling <laughs> tales out of school. Hey, here comes the new girl. Oh, hi, fellas. Right, Who, Who was, was that? that? That's Gypsy. She works in financial. Well, I'm in love again, and <laughs> I love, love, love it. <laughs> oh, darn it, Tom. You fall in love every Monday morning. Get a grip on yourself, man. Yeah, get a and grip. You're not much better. <laughs> Joel, I know, but it's the smell of copy machine toner and whiteout that makes my soul soar. I'm a man in love. Commercial sign in five, four, three, two. Commercial sign now. Hey. That was my brother in law, and the whole family is sick about it. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's sick. Well, what do you think, JR? I. Yeah. Like it. <sighs> it's not funny in the least, but I like it. You know, there's not a single man in my organization that'll tell that kind of lousy joke. Yeah. Oh, the mads are coming. Right. Here comes the steam shovel. Mmm. Chug, 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 chug. Open. Oh, go. Come. There you go. There you go. Who's a good boy? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Yes, yes, yes. Ooh, big steam shovel. Here it comes. Here it comes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Little on there. There you go. There you go. There you go, a little bit more. Little, what is it? What do you see? What do you? Oh, Joel, it's you. Um, why don't you go ahead with your invention exchange? I've got to put the little dickens down. Okay. Well, since you have a new addition to the family, I thought this would come in useful. It's an air freshener mobile. Hmm. You see, mm -hmm. it's uh, got bright colored air fresheners that hang from strings. Hmm. They stimulate baby's tiny brain, oh. while the movement of the mobile activates charcoal filters, <laughs> covering up the foul odor of baby's chechar, caca, popo, nimbus, BM, and poopies. Nimbus? Chechar? Nimbus. Uh huh. Ah. Neat. <coughs> so. Yeah. Sure. The hell is Chatter? Shh. Who's a sleepy boo? Frank. Come in here and look at the guy. He's, he's so cute when he sleeps. What is this hideous thing you've put on my baby? What have you done? What have you done? Frank, relax. It's my invention this week, Joel. It's the alien teething nook. To baby, it's a satisfying nipple. To onlookers, it's a terrifying alien face hugger. Why don't you tell Joel about the experiment this week, Frank? I like it. 
Well, Joel, Daddy O is the movie you'll see, but first, here's one for Baby and me. <laughs> I'll get it. White Castle Hamburgers film. Wow, does this mean where it's too cold to go off for recess? Takes awful bad and 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 takes a is for airplanes that fly Oh, great. I just know I'm going to sit next to one of those people. people. And cows that mm. say moo. Must be coach class. Mm. And sometimes a cute little piggy or two. Ah, oh, but now you have to call them flight attendants. I'd like to fly in a boot, wouldn't you? Yes, the modern aircraft, unsurpassed in its service to livestock. B's for boat. A boat that can float. A boat full of guys dressed up like goats. Hmm? Just to show that they know what a pleasure it is just to be in a boat. Looks like more like B is for back problem. Bootsy oh, Collins. That looks like the Harvard Sculling Team. Stroke. C is for cat. Huh? Cute little cat. Tortured the cats. Cutest little kittens ever seen. Kitty. A cat can wear a funny hat. A cat can dress up like a little queen. If you're into that sort of Tom thing. Cats and Sally cats, pussy cats and alley cats, with mm -hmm. silky tails and nice soft paws. It's evil. And a cat like Santa Claus. Oh, do go on. D is for dancing. Mm -hmm. See the children dance. Get off my That's toe. The they dance way up in Iceland. D is for damned, as in village dance. of. Ooh. Iceland looks like such a nice land. Hey, Marsha, want to go get a Bosco after the dance? You will dance with me, Eva? Cassie! You know, I don't get to do as much Icelandic dancing as I'd like. All in a row. Bigger than anything else that can grow. He is for electrodes to prop them like up. A great long nose that's bigger than a It's the Republican hole. National Convention. Elephants have babies, too. But even the babies are bigger than you. Okay, now cough. Ah! <laughs> F is for fun. Fun in the sun. Fun in the schoolyard when classes are done. Fun on the hot slide it's when you burn your bones. Pleasant so all the children can play together. Johnny ride the pony, prisoner's base, hopscotch, sliding, paper chase, tag, Ooh, you're it, and run, keep run. And unsafe That's toys for everyone. You know, I never had that much fun as a kid. Nobody did. It's a child farm. Oh, oh my goodness. G is for the big giraffe. Huh. Gee, what a giant is I want a clock bar. When the big giraffe gets a pain in the neck, what a pain that pain must be. And how happy that makes me. <laughs> Age is for Holland. Sweet little Holland. Home of the windmills and tulips and such. And no a child labor laws. Land known as the Netherlands. No wonder the Dutch love their Holland so much. Hmm? They say the Dutch wear shoes that are made of wood, and it's true. They say the Dutch make cheese that is very good, and it's true. It'll plug you they up for an hour or two. a happy place with a happy race <laughs> where they make... Look out, there's a huge shapely woman lounging next to the boat. Oh! I is for in. A little word that means an awful lot. I is in for Ike. He hides inside. Him. When he's in, he's in. He's out when he's not. Ooh, deep. So is he in there, too? J is for jumping a fence. J is for jumping a wall. J is for the jump, but B is for the bump you get when you jump and you fall. And you break your back, neck, pelvis, and all. <laughs> K is for kites that sail so high. With big, K scary K faces and scrawny eyes. kids. There are kites like birds and kites like sails. There are kites with faces and kites with tails. Hmm. Uh -huh. oh, oh, oh. K is for oh. kids who love to fly them. And here is a papa who loves to buy them. That kid is huge. L is for large. The large balloon. Elvis has ordered an ice cream cone. Like a pup. They're nice to see. <laughs> especially when you don't have to blow them up. And there's Elvis now. Ah, uh, looks like Charles Durning. <laughs> and here comes Louie Anderson. Hey. <laughs> M is for the marching men in uniform and braid. M is for the military M machine. Many kids who cheer them on parade. When you put your hand in a bunch of goo that a moment before was your best friend's face, you'll know what to do. 
N is for nursery stories and rhymes. N is for float. Told to the children at sleepyhead time. You hear them at night when you're drowsy and yawning. And then... Hey, there's a woozle and his name is Peanut. It's morning. Hey, it's David Dukes atop that goose. Always for one. Once? Always for once? Was it a writer's strike? To pull the farmer's plow. So he was whipped and beaten and battered about. I beat. I can't put up a fight anymore. The elephant showed him how. Always for the obscene treatment of animals. The camel showed him how. <laughs> It's a normal plow animal. P is for PETA, who's boycotting this. How. And this, and this. See how the farmer is chasing him now. <laughs> P is for the pool that makes hey. you very cool when you're a hot hippopotamus. It's Tom and Roseanne. He jumps as a rule on the top of the pool, but he also can rest on the bottom of Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Um, buddy. I'm going to go get a beer. Q is for the queer, queer pelican, <laughs> whose beak can hold more than his pelican. P is for plagiarism from Ogden Nash. It is true, he probably thinks the same of you. Yeah, but he's got a brain like a chickpea. R is for ribbons. Ribbons that deck the maypole, rippling, floating, hey, free and clear. these are all boys. Huh? Nice it should Man. come twice instead of once in every year. Hey, there's Jack Klugman and Tony Randall. S is for squirrels drinking milk. And biting the heads I off shrews. Fur like silk. Diseases like rabies. <laughs> oh, that's good stuff. <laughs> he is for trying terribly hard to drink from the clothesline in the yard. T is for tormented, tortured, and teased. Hey, what do you have to do to get a drink around here? Dress like a bear and stand on your hind legs? Ha! U is for up. Oop. Balloons go up, Oop. and planes go up, Oop. and so do kites. U is for upchuck that comes from balloons. My stairs go up. And Boy, is she down. ever high. Huh? These were vegetables. Corn and squash, peppers and beans and succotash. Carrots, celery, and tomatoes. Also, naturally, mashed potatoes. Hey, Boo Radley. I have to pee. Hey. Well, he is. In your garden, plant a seed. Carefully hunt out every weed. It's the Georgia That's Juvenile the Correction garden, System. Dave. You will find a vegetable plate. Get out of here, I'm working. W is for walking, two by two. Trees can't walk and stones can't walk, but little children mm -hmm. do. Oh, and every oh. day to school you go to learn the things you ought to know. Mm -hmm. But please, dear children, don't forget you already know. I the hate my job, I hate my job. Then after walking, you advance to learning how to do a dance. Help, Help us! Help us! X is for Xmas. Merry Christmas. X is for existential when dilemma. Santa Claus comes in his big red sleigh, bringing lots of games and toys to good little Good night, everybody. Enjoy the buffet. Thank you, my great. Why is for young? And why is for you? Uh -huh. At a wonderful what? age when the world oh. is new, and every sky is clear and blue. And the summer days are never through. <laughs> why is for young? So why is for you? Get it? Yeah, well, why is for Yanni as far as I'm concerned? Why is the chemical symbol for heavy metals that the fish is full of? Check it out. <laughs> Z is for zebra. Remarkable sight. Mm -hmm. Has white stripes on black. Or is it black stripes on white? Well, the, good, huh? the zebra makes a useful pet, and he finished up the alphabet. I hope we've touched you with a little bit of our evilness. Daddy O. Must be Harry O's father. Or Wendy O's dad, maybe. Well. <laughs> hey, Cantino, for fine Italian food at its best. Central High's marching band plays beat movie favorites. Yeah. You know, if the stars in this show are so unimportant, just think how these people feel. I it's bet. That'd be awful. Oh, I bet Firestone Tires finance this. <laughs> oh, no. John Williams, before we heard Stravinsky. <laughs> but I kid Stravinsky. <laughs> hey, you're going over the center line. Oh. And introducing Morton Tuber as Mr. Potato Head. Oh. He's fried. Elmer C. Roden 
Jr., I think we've all enjoyed Elmer and his fine glue products. Hey, do you want to go over to Lou's place? Oh, Lou. You're 11. <laughs> I know one thing, I live my life. I think this is Duel 2, the trucker's story. Uh -huh. Turn left! Action Pat! Huh? Oh wow, and a love scene already? It hurts, it really hurts! That felt good. Oh, well, maybe this is the Jane Mansfield story. <laughs> Look out for the playground! It's Dean Jones and Buddy Hagen the Love Boat! Oh, fun. Come on, Muffin. All right, Broderick, out of the car. Huh? You touch me and I'll split your head open. Ooh. You crazy little idiot. Hey, Mr. Douglas. What's the matter, lady? You should be on the highway. That's what's the matter. I ask her, pal. He ran me off. Yeah, and if you were a man, baby, I'd knock your teeth out. I am. He's been following me for the last hour. Trying to pick me up, I guess. Is that a rake? Are you kidding? Uh -huh. She almost caused a three-car pilot back there, passing me on a blind hill. That's a lie. Ooh. The first time I saw him, he drove alongside, blowing his horn and smiling. Man, you ought to be ashamed. He's been bothering I'm losing, me for the last I? half hour. Big operator. Come on, you guys. She could have pulled away from me in two seconds with that car. Yeah, but she was delirious yeah, from the smell of bleach. Huh? Sure, little lady. Hey, check out my electric hat. He ain't gonna bother you, none. Ay, que linda. What did he say? He said he doesn't he need no stinking tall. badge. Thanks. Listen, doll. Huh? You're gonna kill somebody driving like that. Thanks. Go so along now. Happy motoring. You're a big help. Back oh. to your Rolls Royce, Romeo. Say, are those chicks? Next time, get someone you can handle. Ah, ah, Come on, oh. Mac. I'm coming, I'm coming. This time I drive. Ooh, a water slide. No, 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 I don't think so. Oh. Today's youth hopped up on crack, crystal milk, formaldehyde process opium, tar heroin, and pomade. It's a middle aged teenager. Hi, gang. Here's a gesture for you. Hi. Hey, count all the midriff bulges. What do you say? Hey, man, don't how's touch it going? me. What's happening, people? Oh, things are moving. I sure like to hear. <laughs> things are moving. Hey, Barney, give me a oh. beer, will you? Only one? Yeah, one. Things uh, really swinging tonight, huh? Yeah, if you stay here long enough, you might see somebody's knees. Oh, <laughs> Hey, you're not with it tonight, man. He hasn't said a word all night. All I can think of is deaf, deaf hey, man. Is your mom okay? She's okay. Well, I thought maybe she was a She's fine. Oh, geez, Dad. Well, then what's the matter with you, buddy? Nothing. My mother's a saint. Just don't feel good. Sick? No. Got a stomach ache? No, I don't know what's the matter with him. He just needs a little medicine, that's all. Hey, Barney! Give us another, will you? Hey, Barney! Give me a 30 count of 200 milligram Tagamet. Excuse me, pardon me, coming through. Pregnant lady. Oh, look, I'm spilling, I'm spilling. Look out, oh. Hey, check it out. It's Los Lobos with Steve Allen on base. Cool, buddy. Stick around, we got karaoke coming up next. Greetings. How's it going, man? Oh, fair. Hey, maestro? Yeah. That music's pretty bad. Man, you wouldn't know a beat if you heard one. Back off, man. Thanks, Barney. For nothing. Wow! Stretch pants, sir. I know that chick. I know that chick. It's your sister, you dope. You keep your mind on mama. Oh, hey, mama. Yeah. Over this way. You know, she could go home and cinch her waist more. But you mean no pal of mine. Jan Ryan. Played at the party her place last, uh, when was it? May. Yeah, last May. Yep. Jan, this is, uh, Peg Lawrence. Hi. Ugly guy next to her is Duke Mannion. Go Thanks. Ahead. Thanks a lot. Hi, Duke. This is Sonny DeMarco. He's kind of screwy inside. And last and least, Phil Sandifer. I've already met Phil. You yeah. have? Phil, wake up! Today. Camera's on! Uh -oh. Uh -oh. 
Oh, my underpaid, underprivileged musicians. Underpants. Up here. Third the one. Now, on behalf of Mr. Barney Waters, our friendly, smiling... Yeah. Oh, kitty sweet. He's a sensitive man. Easily hurt. Uh. I see Phil Sandifer is hiring us with his presence. <laughs> <laughs> How about a song from old daddy-o himself? Go on. Your singing can't be any worse than your driving, daddy-o. You haven't heard my singing yet, honey -o. Hey, it's Captain Kangaroo and Mr. Green Jeans out clubbing. He's singing the left side of the menu. You know, you'd look great in a dancing bear costume. I don't mind telling you. Rock candy, baby. Sweeter than a liquor stick. She's having second thoughts. Mm -hmm. Crazy like a lollipop when I get one taste. I don't want to stop for oh, rock candy, baby. Ooh, that's what I call my dream. Woo! Oh, Boy, rock not a necktie baby. to be seen. Where's our country going? Well, 9 30, everybody, that's curfew. Let's go. What is that? Grease up there in the ceiling? Ooh, grease is the word. I really love her so. Oh, he's really generous, isn't he? Oh, rock candy, baby. Sweetest little gal I know. Oh, my God, he's got a gun. Oh, oh they're, they're taping roller coaster here. <laughs> That cat's crazy. He's blowing nuts, man. Blowing what? You mean out of the saxophone? Yeah. Blowing nuts? Oh. Rock, 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 candy, baby. Rock, 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 candy, baby. Baby. Rock, 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 candy, baby. baby. Rock, candy, baby, you're mine. Am I rock sweet candy? Cherry, poison, very sweeter than coffee. I'm getting hungry. Yeah, well, now he's singing about the continental candy, breakfast. Yeah. Rock, candy, baby, you're mine. Woo! You know, I don't think this song is endorsed by the ADA. No, no. I think so. Here's the lyric I wrote. A death, death, can we Not now. We'll have ample time later. Now let's have some of that rock candy. Rock, rock, rock candy, baby. Please, 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 end the song now. Please, 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 end the song now. Rock candy, baby, you're mine. Rock candy, baby, You know, this is inspirational, guys. Let's get out of here. Rock candy, baby, you're mine. You know, I think we talked over the only Dick Cantina song in the whole movie. Oh. Hey, fix your belt, Dick. Everybody do the pants up song. That lad bearer, Levi's Buca boy, sends a Bacino's hang a band roll on a power wrangler. Johnny Carson Huskies, no pants are higher than mine. Ha ho, look out, no touches. Ha, hike up your britches. Super high now, I'll cut off the circulation to your thighs now. Yank your trousers higher than Corey Ames. Oh wow. Cause it ain't hip till you're in total pain. Hike up your pants till you see your shins wearing eyes on shirt like a second skin. Make sure you wear your belt buckle to the side. Hike up your pants, take your butt cheeks for a ride. Hey! Hike, hike, hike up your chinos. Hike, hike, hike up your ferris. Hike, hike, hike up your haggis. Hike up your britches like my take it, Frank. Hike. Hike, hike, hike your pants up. Hike, hike, hike with the thing in the. Hike, hike, hike with the the football. Hike, hike. Take it, doctor. Hike, I'm not taking hike, anything, hike, Frank. Hike, Here, hike take these. Hike, 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 and you, hike, pants hike, weasel, hike, get on with it. Hike, hike, hike your pants up. Zip hike, it, Frank. Hike, hike, hike up your band rolls. Hike, hike, hike up your robots. Hike, hike, hike up your tough skin. Hike up your britches like mine. Ha! Hike up your britches like mine. Ha! Hike up your britches like mine. Ha! Oh yeah, look out! Hike up my britches like mine. Jump back, kiss myself. Uh, Joel, Hike up your britches sign. like mine. Joel, I can't Joel, come back. back. I Joel! Know. Joe, commercial sign. Snap out of it, buddy. No, he's paper locked. Hike hit the button, Crow. Hit the button. I'll get it. Oh, very 
nice film. Thank you. Okay now, Joel? Yeah, I was fine. I think you bored her. Amused would be more like it. I'll sing it. Looks like girl. Let's get a little exercise. Oh? Crazy kids. I don't think she likes me. Why should she? You insulted her. I did. That's right, by insulting me. And by insulting me, you insult all men everywhere. I think you have talent. It's just that I think it'll be a while before you catch up to Frankie. Singer, where does he work? He's a truck driver. How do I know? It's supposed to be good for you. Sure, why not? Hmm? Die, death, Albuquerque. Some enchanted evening. <laughs> what? What? You coming on to me? I don't like the way you're holding me, Phil. Hmm? But you don't, baby. Look, the high school crush won't work with me. Oh, and then how about a half Nelson? Hammerlock. I'm not kidding. Oh, sophisticated type, huh? <laughs> really been around. I'll have to know what you've got on your mind. Yeah, like six handfuls of pomade. Ooh. Come on. And then throw it right back in their face. Oh, huh? like a monkey, I will. Ooh. You kill me, baby. Do not I? yet, honey. I'm glad. Look, I think we'll sit this one. Better towel down. Yeah, I'm gonna do some lat pulls. Oh, now wait a minute, doll. Let me straighten you out. You eat like an open book. I knew what you were when I laid eyes on you. Really? So when you go around flirting with truck drivers and come into a joint like this. Okay, now whose breasts are bigger here? Uh, oh, I, oh. Finished? Yeah. I can get this kind of abuse at the Kennedy I Mansion. I do what I want, and I do what I want. And it's none of your damn business. You got me. Dance doll? Ooh. I'd love to. Boy, maybe you should have shaved his arms before tonight. Like my hair? I just mowed it. <laughs> Who's in a swanky part of town? What a pad. That old man's got more dough than Jack Benny. Hmm? They must What'd be sitting in the slang yeah. section. Yeah, mm -hmm. a real square affair. You know, soft drinks, sandwiches, that jazz. But well, it's a deli. Oh. Thanks, Johnny. Let me know if you change your mind. No, I don't want a flat top. Be careful, that one, sweetie. He's too eager. Don't worry. I got the message. What's the matter with you, Phil? Letting her dance with a character like that. He's mad at me. How come? Beats me. Oh, he does? I'm the one that should be mad after oh. the way he shoved me off the highway today. Yeah. He uh, uh, must have learned from a correspondence school. <laughs> Are you serious? Phil's got a drawer full of drag race trophies. Or he's a stunt driver in a carnival when he is 15. Well, I'm mm. just a girl, and I'll race him any time, any place. Ooh. Careful, sweetie. You're on thin ice. Well, how about it? Go on, Phil. She's asking for it. Well, how about it, Barney old Phil? Right now, tonight. You can race to the park, and the finish line will be Nick's. And the loser has to buy the pizza. Ooh, the park goes holy the dark wow. Have all those nice hairpin turns to yourself. Sis me. Phil? Go ahead. Teach her a lesson. I don't think there's anything he could teach me. Oh, yeah? What about Trig or Calculus, Fortran or Cobol? Let's make it. You mean they have to build their cars no, like a soapbox no, I don't derby? Think it's make the scene. Oh. Yeah. Look, I'll be along later. Well, how come? I gotta make a call. See if my mom's all right. At the mortuary. Go ahead, we'll uh... wait for you. No, I might have to go home for a while. Okay. Uh -huh. See you at Nick's, huh? Phil? We're all gonna die alone and afraid. Yeah. Hold on to this for me. You know, I'm kinda screwed up and anything can happen to me. I'd like a good smoke. Where's Sonny? It's Cher. Sonny coming, man? No. Yeah, he'll be along later. Let's cut out. Yeah, crazy. Cool. Now, is that Brian Dennehy or Charles Sterning? This is a job for Super Team. I think I know where I can find him. Teen Mobile on. I've got to get into the Teen Mobile. Zit gun set for high. Hey, it's Cannon. You can't walk out on me. I'm Charles Foster King. Now we see Tom McHale test a 53 Ford Victoria, and it really performs. It's a big, bulky car. You see, it doesn't matter how slow I go. I'll catch him. My son's the editor. Hey, it's a Sunday Night NBC Mystery Movie. Whoa! What is going on? Who is that? Wait a minute. Whoa! The cutaway caught fire. 
now on the border of Czechoslovakia and East Germany. Ha, <laughs> cute little clown car. Ha, <laughs> cute. Vandals! Stole the handles. Whoa. They're young. Do you know your way through, Janet? Blindfolded. Well, so be it. Cancel out. Ask him. Okay, just don't forget this run isn't banked. Hmm. It takes more skill than speed. Hmm. When you get to the fork, go either left or right. Both of them wind I've been up through here a thousand times. How about the other gate? We'll, we'll take the highway around. Have it open before you get there. Anything goes, Daddy O. Oh, that hurts. <sighs> Something like Marlena Dietrich all of a sudden. You ready, Janet? Bill? John Frankenheimer directs Race for the Pizza. All Newman and Tom Cruise in The Color of Days of Thunder, the car, Christine, Herbie. I like mine with thin crust. Oh, just like Ben Hur. I like mine Chicago style. I ain't buying no pizza. Ooh, wait a minute. How do you get on that side of our Tyco change up track? Hmm. Huh? Hey, hold it, you. Hey, come back here. Here, have some gum. Kid? Kid? I'm an adult. Like, I'm only 43 and everything. Gotham City, 14 months. Cut away. Cut away. Cut away. Cut away, kids game. Cut away. Cut away. Stuffed pizza and crazy bread. Pizza, pizza. He should be here any second now. Our pert little racer is wearing a wool gabardine slack and kicky modified trench. She's a real deuce coop. Hi. Danny Thomas. I just don't believe it. The things I can do with my spirograph. Where'd you pass it? Just after the start. No one's ever beaten him through there before. Well, no one else has these. He had engine trouble. He had trouble, all right. Me. Come on, little piece of British crap. And I'm finally going to get this car back to Billy Barty and a chili pepper burn my gut and order cheese bread. She's going to do it. And... Pizza's here. <laughs> I'm telling you, baby, if you were a man, I'd knock your head off. You said that once before. Ran me off. What do you the mean? road? No, it just ran me oh, off. Maniac <laughs> here forced me onto a dirt road. Like I said, anything goes. Cole Porter. You didn't wreck your car. No, but I almost hit a night watchman. <laughs> you mean the old guy with the station wagon? That's right. <laughs> he was coming up that dirt road. I bet he jumped right out of his winter underwear. <laughs> <laughs> Very funny. If he got my license number, I've had it. Oh, relax, pal. He's probably so scared he doesn't even remember his own name. Yep. Carl. My, my name's Carl. But I got his license number. What? A, a, a pancake? No, we ordered pizza. Later, baby. Okay. I'll get the syrup. Oh, wow. I don't know about the rest of you gourmets, but I could go for another one. I'm buying. Come on, don't be a bad sport. No. Can't you leave him alone? He's upset. It's tough enough losing the race. I don't want him to go home hungry, too. Yeah, and besides that... Oh, shit. Cops in Stillburn location 20 years ago. Hey, you're facing the wrong way for the driving. Give me your attention, please. My name's Phil, and I'm an alcoholic. Hi, Phil. HGN 227. Right here. Step out here, will you? Oh, this Walkman works really well. Yeah, we usually beat you up right here, but there's a camera on, so you'll have to get him back. All right, in the back with him, Andy. I want want a donut? Just kidding. <laughs> Little cop humor. What? Oh, no, oh, no, 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 no. Oh. oh. 7.15. Gannon and I headed back downtown. Bunko. Okay, what's the charge? Al Bundy? Hmm? Destruction of property, trespassing, reckless driving, hit and run, and manslaughter. Hmm. Hit and run and manslaughter. Oh, that was just me getting yeah. nuts. I'll change that. Wait a minute. What are you talking about? Hit and run and manslaughter. 
The accident you had in the park. Remember? What accident? Where? I think you sideswiped on Canyon Road. Kid died in that wreck. Hmm. Sideswiped? What car? What, what are you talking about? 49 Ford Blue Coupe. Kid's name was... James Dean? Leonard DiMarco. Hey, I got a felt pen by that name. DiMarco? No. Sonny? Dad! Dead? Mm -hmm. Police examination, having found your vehicle free from scratches, dents, or damage of any kind, upholds your plea of not guilty to charges four and five. Hit and run and manslaughter. You're talking to the narrator? As for charge one, two, and three, destruction of city property, oh. trespassing, and reckless driving. Look, I know all that. The judge read it to me, okay? Do I get the job I just or not? wanted to make sure you understood. Cancel your caller. Call 12 15 has handled. So, you enjoy Adam 12? 379 a.m. Put a guy on probation, take away his driver's license? <laughs> Understood. Ooh. He could have made it a lot worse on you, Phil. I'd say you were pretty lucky. Lucky? Look at this shirt. You call this lucky? Look, Mr. Wooster, my best friend was buried this morning. Yesterday, I lost my job. I can't drive a car for a whole stinking year. Uh-huh. And? I'm sorry about the DeMarco kid. Close, huh? Some guys have got brothers. I had Sonny. Where are you folks, Phil? I ran away when I was 14. The old man and old lady didn't even bother to look for me. Oh. Well, I'll let you in on something. I ran away when I was 15. Does that tell you anything? Oh, what? I understand you work for a carnival. Yeah. Yeah, That's I bet right. the head's off chickens. Daredevil driving act. Oh. I didn't have much sense in those days. Is that why you drive like an idiot? What are you talking about? I know what I can do, and I know what that car can do. Hmm? I've never been in an accident. I've never caused one. Yeah, I know, Phil. You're a real fine driver. But what about a job? Is that tickle? I don't know. I don't have a driver's license. The law fixed that. Well, see what you can find. If you can't get anything by next week, I'll give you a hand. Not a job, just a hand. I have your friend's hand in the drawer. <laughs> can I go now? Unless you want some coffee. I'll get the cream. Bill? Yeah? Anytime you need me. I'll be this big. I'm here. Uh, you know, Phil, I know a wiener man. He wants a hot dog stand. You know, he gives me everything from wieners on down. What are you going to do now, man? Oh, smoke. Uh, I don't know. I haven't given it much thought. Why don't you try Barney? He might give you a job singing. Yeah. Hey, Duke, where is that crazy chick with? Francis Farmer? Yeah, Jan. <laughs> I didn't think you'd be so anxious to see her again. Oh, I need my eyes picked Remember back. when I told you I took the right fork? During the race? Yeah. Well, I actually well, use a mountain, salad a place for it. It's kind of dumb. A place where you could see almost all the way down. Oh, man, every lover knows that. Yeah, but when I was up there and looked down, I didn't see anybody ahead of me. That means that Jana took the left port, right? right. Left, right. Third, Third base. base. <laughs> Points. Sonny was killed on the left port. Let's go there now. That's it. Nice little chicken coop, huh? Thanks, dude. Isn't that where Darren and Samantha live? Hey, Sherlock. She's a better girl than you think she is. Sure. Thank you, Walton. Hey, wait, that's his ride! Oh, he's gonna have to walk. Yeah, sure, make yourself at home, boy. Nah, yeah, just gonna do a little tinkering. Gonna putz around a little, you know. I hate all of you, you inanimate objects. You mock me by your silence. Come on. I can take you. Come on. <laughs> it's a George Barris custom car kit. Ooh. You're my best friend in the world. No one understands me. Oh, you've lost... Oh, that's the Trying mom. to find out what makes it run so fast? Yeah, what does that? You ran Sonny DeMarco off the road, didn't you? Ran him off just like you did me. <laughs> Want some? Mm. Oh, I, I hate Granny answer. Smiths. He was still at the gardens when we left. There's a shortcut to Canyon Road. He must have gotten there, Hetty. If your friend had too much to drink, don't blame me. That's a new headline. And that's touch up paint. Now admit it. Sure Leave me alone or I'll call the police. No, my head's not an apple. You admit you killed Sonny. I almost ran off myself, smashed my headlight. Oh, you liar. If I'd forced him off, my right fender would have been smashed. 
right. Now kiss me. Sorry. I'll have that apple now. Huh? Huh? All I want's coffee. Two coffees black, huh, honey? Thanks, Mom. Nice caboose. What am I saying? I gotta check something. What? My check. This. What is it? I don't know. Sonny gave it to me just before the race. I think it was the key to his heart. Looks ordinary enough. Ah, oh, here's Peggy Lee with the coffee. You give that out there. She's a tramp. Yeah, that's the trouble. With tribbles? Yeah. Do you really think somebody did it on purpose? You saw the skid marks. On my underwear. Oh, oh that's it. Oh, sorry. 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 The whole time I was at the table. Sonny was a big baby. He was scared. Real scared. Letty scared. What kind of scared? I went to his house that day and I found the... Oh, oh, this isn't a flashback. Sorry. What is it? Where were you? Did you leave the iron on? Did you see Sonny's mother? Yeah, the nurse only let me see it for about five minutes. What about the key? Says it belongs to uh, his gym locker. Jan, I think we're on to something. Well, would you let the audience in on it? Ask me if I knew about a bank account Sonny opened in her name. A bank account for 5,000 skins. Oh, he was a trapper. Check it out. Bruce's gym and church. Mm. Oh, I see. It's a secretarial school. Mm. Can I help you, bud? Yeah, I got to get something out of a locker. Nobody but members is allowed back there. Hey, it's Joe Cocker. Well, look, a buddy of mine died, and his mother asked me to clean out his locker. Yeah? What's his name? Well, why can't he do DeMarco. it himself? Leonard DeMarco. I can see through your clothes now. I never heard nothing about it. Well, anyway, he had an auto accident. Now, can I get his stuff? I'll take care of it. <laughs> I got his key right here. Couldn't help you if I wanted to, fella. Oh. Gym policy. Oh, come on, Mac. Only take five minutes. Look, fella, I'm busy. Now, hand over the key. I'll take care of it later. Uh -huh. I'll just keep it until you do, Jack. Jack? Fella? See, those pants are kind of high, aren't they? Let's have it, fella. Sure. <laughs> Thanks, come again. <laughs> come on, Joel, hurry up. Okay. Do you know your way through, Janet? Blindfolded. You can cancel. Ask him. All right, Cambot, roll that race footage. On your marks, get set, go! Darn fool kids. Okay, and now you both win a delicious pizza! Wait, where's Joel? Oh no, we've killed him! Joel Robinson, dead at 31. Oh no! I was just kidding you guys, you know. We gotta get him on his own! Right, good thing we were thrown clear of those cars, huh? Yeah. Don't you think we better wait? There may be someone there. Look, we might even be too late now. Well, how are you going to get in without a key? With this. That's what this is for. Now, give me the flashlight and get back in the car. I'm going with you. I said get back in the car. You leave me here and I won't be here when you get back. Hey, remember what he did to the apple. Oh. All right, come on, bullhead. Dickweed. I don't think we're ever going to find any night crawlers. Keep it on my ankle. Now, would you please? <laughs> This place must have a wood-burning nautilus. 
all that lumber back there. <laughs> Got to think. Must try to think, but too stupid. Ooh. Well, back to cat burglar school. Yep. <laughs> Right. Sonny's mom asked me to clean out his locker, and that's just what I intend to do. Come on. Yeah, I like to watch. Anything grow? It helps if you hop. This must be. Yep, just as I thought. Nitrogen filled double glazed triple paned Anderson windows. This should be easy. I think we can squeeze through there. You go first. Ow, oh, that's my nose! Ow, oh, ow! Oh. Hey, it's the Sunday mystery movie out there. That's it. In you pixies come through the window. Bruce's gym now with three full pieces of equipment. Come here. On my ankle, like I said. Hey, nice rattle collection. Oh, don't ring the bike bell. Bruce the gym. Hey, it's the reporter from Citizens oh, Kane. Oh, no. Not by tomorrow morning. I said tomorrow morning. Yeah, come in through the window. I'll leave it open. Hey, let's make shadow puppets together. They came in through the bathroom window, didn't they? Yeah, protected by a silver spoon. Quick, under the barbell! Quick, get into the coin slot! It's too obvious. The boy wasn't intelligent enough to choose the obvious. Maybe. I don't know why you couldn't have done it by Give yourself. Give me that. The shower. Oh, Daddy, oh, you're such No, no, instead of waiting for me. Well, I wanted you here when I opened it. Because I think you're funny. Who's to I detect? It's not possible you think I don't trust you. I just wanted you here, that's all. I assure you, if I didn't trust you 100%, I'd trust you 60%. I wouldn't even have considered you for this operation. I don't need an operation, it's hey, just my eyes. you know the rules about smoking in here. Smoke with a cigar. It's like exotic perfume compared with the air in here. Hey, I'm in there. Oh no, that's me here. Uh, let's see, jock strap. Oh. Another jock strap. Nothing yet. Uh, this guy really likes jock straps. Wait a minute. Huh? It's my brain. <laughs> yep, found it. Well, the joke's on me, isn't it? You think nobody has a brain but you? Quite to the contrary, Bruce. I'm the first to bow to superior intellect. Just that I very rarely encounter it. <laughs> <laughs> well, you schneidered me on that one, boss. You shamed old Bruce. Hold it. I want to get that shower. Make it fast. Can't stand the odor in here much longer. Want the lights? Um, yeah. Would you scratch my ear? Never mind. I got it. I guess with you it doesn't make any difference. <laughs> Probably see just as well in the dark. <laughs> yep, got me again, boss. Yep, you did. Hey, let's shower in our clothes just for a lark. <laughs> Jeez, it smells like a locker room. Oh, it is. Hmm. A teddy, a jock, a side of beef, and that Funicello poster? Edgar Allan Poe poetry? Died of jock itch. Uh, Whatever it was, we missed it. We huh? Oh, Return to Papillon. Hmm. Hey. A Surgeon General warning. Hey, that's from Catalina Caper. What the? Oh. This is great. We're having an adventure just like the Goonies. I wish we knew what they took out of that locker. Yeah. Maybe if we knew that, we know why Sonny's dead. You think they're the ones? I don't know. I don't know. But ever since he joined this gym, he seemed to change. Yeah, he got bulkier. Well, he had something on his mind. Water. Something that was really bugging him. <laughs> Whenever I'd ask him about it, he'd clam up. 
Maybe it was because of his mother. Hey, his mother was a saint. That's what I figured, too. But now... Yeah? I wonder. What? What? Hey, put on Dude Looks Like a Lady. I love that. <laughs> hmm. All right, I'll have the pork rind ball to load omelet in a Diet Coke, please. Did you ask him? Ask who what? Ask Barney about a job. What else? No. Well, let's try now. Hey, Barney. Huh? Google. Barney, how would you like to double your business? No, thanks. What's the joke? <laughs> no joke. All you have to do is hire Phil here, and I'll personally guarantee that within a month's time, your business will be doubled. Hire him as what? Well, as a singer. What else? He's lucky I let him in here to sing. Don't worry, laughing boy. It won't happen again. Take it easy. Uh, get it. Uh, excuse me. I'm Sidney Chillis. I'd like to talk with you. May I buy you a drink? I'm in a hurry, Mac. It uh, might be worth your while. A clue. A clue. A clue. It's yeah. A clue. I'll have a beer. Beer. That's a clue. Wow, I'm my own Saturday night thing. It's a drive-up stunt service. You feel sand of it? You Lou Reed? Yeah, that's right. Marsha Hayes, Mr. Chillis Manicures. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. It's real. I've seen these. They're nice. You're a lucky woman. I guess you must pay pretty well. It's not mine. It belongs to Mr. Chillis. He lets me use it for errands. Get in. Wanted. Manicurist for an evil slot. Alrighty. Photo a must. Oh, these seats are hot. So you're the new singer. Yep, Isaac Basher, the singer. Didn't say I take it yet. I hope you do. Because I want you to go on and. Uh, they make love on the highways, love in the byways, love in the streets. <laughs> Boy, they went all out for this grand opening. See, you put one foot in front of the other, and then you're walking in the door. You call them stairs. Yeah. Now, I know this is bad luck, but you're already in the movie. This will all be finished by tomorrow night. Huh? Right here a second. Huh? <laughs> Beetle Bailey, what's Where he up to singer? now? <laughs> yeah, where's Sydney? Where do you think? All right, go in. You modest. What do you think? <laughs> Sydney, singer's here. What, are they in a double-wide trailer? Hi, still here. Get him out of here. Toga, 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 toga. What on earth is wrong? Well, let's get out there. He's the one who come in about DeMarco's locker. So? But he had the key. Maybe no key. Come over in. here and start on my back. Then get me my Filipino houseboy. You? Hmm? Now, Bruce, you don't think for a minute I'd blunder haphazardly into this. I've done some checking on this boy. He was a friend of Leonard's, a very close friend. So you see... It's only natural he'd want to clean out the boy's locker. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but suppose he sees me here. He's going to see you. But he'll get wise to everything. Keep working. You've overstimulated your heart. And grossed us you all standing out. around. You're my personal masseur. Hmm. Who's a more logical candidate for that position but a uh, gym manager? Uh, and suppose, her? just suppose he is suspicious. What a better place to have him than right here under our noses. <laughs> Ouch! You see, Bruce, your little tantrum was all for nothing. He's basting in butter. <laughs> okay, he's your responsibility. Right. Of course, he's my yeah. responsibility. I, I promise to feed him twice a day and take him for a walk. Unless we have someone to make the deliveries, we're out of business. Unfortunately, I don't have the stomach for that sort of thing, and you don't have the eyes. <laughs> you got me. Bruce, let's be honest. This movie Neither sucks. Neither of us can carry a tune. <laughs> oh, yeah, that too. <laughs> okay, Hanson. Okay. You smell like Captain Kangaroo. Mm. Come in, Jedediah. Pour yourself some Paul Messon. Sorry to keep you waiting, Philip. I was in the middle of a steam bath. That's all right. No, it's not. It's downright rude. 
I hope right, you'll forgive right. me. Now, let's see. You know Marsha? The gentleman on the chair is Mr. Green, my monsieur. We've met. Oh, you have? Hmm. You're the one who came in about the DeMarco kid's locker. Yeah, and you're the one who can't see beyond That's his right nose. A friend of his was enrolled in the gym. Doing real fine, too. Had an auto accident. I certainly hope it wasn't anything serious. He died. Ooh. My condolences. Mm. What can you say in a situation like this? Words are so meaningless. I like to say a really bad joke. Well, uh, what do you think of my club? Foot. Hmm? I think it's very nice. I put in a great deal of thought into making the high note an inducement for our young people to gather for wholesome fun and music. And evil. Oh, look, Mr. Chillis, uh, you know my problem. I'm on probation. No driver's license. And Well, I explained that last night. Indeed you did. And just as I promised, I've come up with a solution. And we'll inject it straight into uh, your head. I've got something interesting to show you. Something mm. festive. Come along. No, we're meeting Peter Lawford for dinner. The bartender at the Rainbow Gardens. He told me you've earned all kinds of honors racing cars. Well, yeah, I, I won a few drags. That's why I think you'll appreciate what I have to show you. Well, what do you think of it? Well, it's a tiny statue of St. Francis. You're oh. kidding. <laughs> Wait, my boy, never jump at conclusions. Open the hood. Go ahead. No! Oh, oh, my, my God! God. Oh, that's oh. terrible. Oh, Huh. An express yeah, machine? Fantastic. Well, a house like this needs expert driving. Want to bet I could handle it? <laughs> I'm sure you could. Have you ever thought about being evil? I mean, really evil. Oh, what's the use, Mr. Chillis? Why are we even talking about a job out here? Walk to my office. Let's eat. You like butter? I think this is private enough. Let's eat some butter, gobs of butter, big handfuls. What's this? It's made of butter. Imitation, of course, but a very good one. Hmm. I don't understand. Philip, I find your talent exceptional. And attractive. Instinct tells me you're just what I need to make this club a success. You and drink specials. Are you serious? Quite serious. In this business, success and failure are often measured by such details as who's singing. Believe and me, whose trust you're I've been wearing. long enough to know. Ooh. You really think I'm that good? Good enough to offer, in addition to the salary I quoted last night, that car I showed you, and his license. And big heaping handfuls of butter. Suppose if somebody recognizes me, he'd be taking a risk. <laughs> Any business venture involves risk. Learned that at Harvard Business School, you know. It's true. Hmm? I'll take it on one condition. Name it. You hire the combo from Rainbow Gardens to back me up. <laughs> Agreed, my boy. <laughs> Ow. The driver is either missing or he's... Remember that one? Oh, that's a callback. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hi. No, I wish I was. <laughs> Where'd you get the car? I won it. In a turkey raffle. Wow, you must be really smart. I thought you weren't supposed to be driving. I'm not. I'm walking. Oh, how do you do that? Where are you going? What are you doing? Why? Home. Do you live around here? Do you like cheese? Or pancakes? Bacon? What's your favorite? Do you like the names of lots of fish? Oh. Hey, it's the honeymooners apartment. Hmm. I think it's the Pigeon Sisters. Hi. Is this your room? Go away, will you? Are I you good at sports? Oh, no, you don't. You wouldn't want the police to know you were out driving. Naked. Ooh. Well, you little minx, this is my room pretty much. Come on. Hey, you do have trophies. Hey, my epilady. Yeah, I do have trophies. Now, what do you want? I'm tired. Well, maybe I wanted to apologize. Okay, you're free all? to go. Well, I was out driving tonight, and oh, I wanted to be here with you. You big slab of man, you! 
Fail. One more trophy, I guess, fellas. Hmm. So remember, baby, no one can know who I am or where I went. Oh yes, Superman. Not even Duke and Peg or Patsy. Can't you say you were just working out there? You wouldn't have to explain why. Oh no. No. The more people who know about it, the more chance it has of getting back to my probation officer. Man, if that happens, the game's over. Game over, well, ma'am. Well, I saw him tonight. He says he'll help. Says the boys will keep their mouths shut. They even thought of a new name for me. Name? Well, yeah, I can't take a chance with my real name. Well, Clooney, who are you now? Otto von Cheese Biscuit. <laughs> Daddy. Oh. oh Daddy. That'd make a neat movie yeah. title. <laughs> you know what? I'm beginning to like that name. Wow, these are the rowdiest group of youths since Altamont. Hey, is that a Klaus Oldenburg up there in the wall? Gracias, gracias. Glad to have you gracias. all aboard. Isn't this a swinging place? No. no. Can right we put our play clothes on now? I think is the most. Here he is, daddy -o. Hmm. Hey, daddy -o, can I have the keys to the car -o? Man, this club's electric, huh? Ooh. Well, this is going out to both of you out there in the audience. And that hurts. Okay. Wow, she does look like Lou Reed from the Transformer album. Yeah. Now I get it. Oh, there's that Dudley do right smile again. I'm breaking my own heart. You're just the devil. I will have him. It's a devil in your eyes and a um, Victor Moan is on the phone. He'd like his sound back. America. Breaking my heart by the ventricles. Why couldn't this guy be on the plane instead of Buddy Holly? Yeah. Yeah, that guy's got a patent leather head, I think. Over there, that guy? Mm -hmm. He's singing this to his dead friend. Some people had <laughs> brothers. He had Sonny. <laughs> looks like it's TMJ, too. Or PB Max. I will devour him. I will. Like a slap in his face. And so is she. Hey, look, it's Buster Keaton on guitar. <laughs> Jump cut theater. Mr. Buddy Love. Thank you. I'm doing an oil and loop service in the parking lot afterwards. Feel free to bring your drinks outside. It's, I don't know if you know this, but that's Lou Reed from Velvet Underground. Uh huh? Went out for a smoke. Spied it on the lot. You sure it's hers? See for yourself. Hold it, honey. No, I'm really gonna kill her, even if she isn't a man. Oh, thank you, Phyllis. <laughs> hey, a lamp. Hey, oh, what do you think you're doing? Not really. Achilles, Bruce. <laughs> you saw what he did. Oh, boy. Yes, I saw. Now relax. You're welcome okay. in here at any time, my boy. But I'm a little disappointed you didn't knock or bring any butter. Get your clothes and get out of here. But these you are my clothes. Go on, get out, Jenna. Will someone please enlighten me? Do you two know each other? Just a kid who's been bothering me. Uh, she's the barmaid in the honky tonk downstairs. I should have known. Why the agitation, Philip? There's nothing horrible about being a cigarette girl. Yeah, my brother's one. Is it you coming? Get lost, Daddy-o. Wow, she must have just read Codependent No More, I guess. Yeah, well, there, I'm lost. Hey, it's the Kronos Quartet. <laughs> uh -huh. 
smile. You got a Platt's beer coming, the heartiest, heartiest flavor in the world. <laughs> Sheldon Leonard. They suck. There he is. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, time to prove my manhood. Check this out. Here, hold this. No, that's the candle. Look out. Oh, oh, oh. oh. paraffin. <laughs> Oh, he's an alcoholic and I love him. I won't kiss you at the movies. I won't kiss you in the car. I won't kiss you on the kneecaps. I won't kiss you at the bar. Hey. Oh, look at that set. It looks like he's going to beam up any minute. I wish he would. Oh, here comes the cancer girl. I think she's voguing. Yeah. I hope he doesn't live with his folks. <laughs> it sounds grisly. Man, that doesn't sound like any fun. I don't get it. Look at her nostrils. Whoa. Better one. Better two. Oh, boy. Hey, bird lives, man. It looks like he's holding a bottle of Tabasco sauce, doesn't he? He is hot. Oh. Whoa. Good hand change there. Wow, he's all wild and sassy looking. Yeah. She's thinking she's gonna have to get really drunk. Can't wait. Oh my back! Oh. Oh. oh boy, she's gonna need a cigarette now. It's a, huh? So you just kissed her like that, huh? Do you like your job? Sure. I've had the feeling, well, that you've been trying to avoid me. You're not angry because that girl is working here. That dame can do what she wants. Doesn't make any difference to me. You're still my friend. Splendid. Now I have some good news for you. John 316. I've been given custody of a package. What's in it, I don't know, and furthermore, I don't care. This much I can tell you. It came from Mexico, and I doubt very much if they were trying to save what? postage by not sending it through the mail. What's that got to do with I'm me? coming to that. I've just received word on how to deliver the package. Federal I Express? Need someone mm. with the ability to drive fast and skillfully. I do neither. Mm. What about your boy, Green? <laughs> Poor Bruce can't see beyond the windshield. <laughs> Funny. Sounds risky. Didn't I tell you once... Any business venture involves risk. Mm -hmm. Business venture? Come here, Mark. Come here. Come closer. Sit on my lap, Schnuckums. That is your name, isn't it? Here, I want you to take this butter with This you. envelope contains $750 in cash. And a Snoopy birthday card. I am any judge of character. And I am. That young lady out there would look upon you quite differently if she knew you had that much money in your pocket. Mm. She's got nothing to do with it. What time do you get your pants lowered? We close in 25 minutes. Last call. You have until then to make up your mind whether you like it here or not. Well, You're sure there's no question? When I cross the bridge, I pull over and throw it out the right window. Make certain that it clears the embankment. Right. Here. It's butter. Unfold. You'll notice that it's sealed with wax. I was told if the seal was broken, I'd be in for a good deal of trouble. May I say more? Uh... No. Then I'll see you in an hour. Good enough. Wash that hand. Remember, the car will turn into a pumpkin. When is that butter going to get here? Relax. Have some margarine, boss. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah. Where's the car? I coasted it. <laughs> Didn't want to wake up the chickens. <laughs> I think I've underestimated you. Oh, I could kiss you. <laughs> How about some champagne? It's a buttery little champagne. He never gives me champagne. Uh, uh, one, <laughs> two, three. 
Spoon. Save the coupons? Well, sure. How do you think I got these great games? The creep's been after her all night. He doesn't even smoke. Looks to me like it's the other way around. Hmm, good hey, point. Look, just in case anybody wants to know, my name is Pete Plum. Fruity. Hmm. Customers like Daddy O. Yeah, save it for the bandstand. Too many people are starting to ask my real name. Hmm. Hmm. Why Pete Plum? Because that's what it says on my driver's license. Look, Phil. You gotta quit this whole thing. Soon enough. Mm -hmm. No, right now. Tonight. That's a loss. Look, buddy. I'm onto something big. Something too big to let go. Okay, okay. Now, this next one is the classic Chinese fan, okay? okay. All I do is now I want to take a sip and I want one of you guys to say something surprising to me, okay? okay? Got it, got it, got it. All right. Joel, I'm pregnant with your child. Okay, this next one is called Old Faith right, okay. or Weiler's Geyser of Mirth, okay? Oh. Now, what's going to happen? It's guaranteed to get a laugh, just like clockwork, every 20 minutes in a crowded room. Check it out. Okay, uh, uh, you're covered. I got this one. Do it. Hey, there's a ship coming in the rain. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh boy. Um, that was good. That was a dandy. No, no, there is a ship coming in the rain. Just let me get a glass of water before you do it again, yeah. okay? Yeah. Oh, oh. oh, there is a ship coming into range. Quick camera, give me rocket number nine, pronto. What in the heck? We better bring this up on the Hexfield view screen. See oh, oh no, it's, no, it's yeah, that guy. Sorry about the fender bender, and now uh, give me that key, fella. What are you talking about? Why are you here? Just go away. Really? Oh, oh, crying out loud. Anyway, what a pain. Let's get back to the dribble oh, action. Right. That <laughs> this is really a good cool. one here. <laughs> huh? Look, fella. Gym policy. Yeah, whatever. I gotta have that locker. Yeah, yeah whatever. 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 Okay, so hey, okay, later. so Joe, why is the dribble take funny? <laughs> what? <laughs> why is it? It's only the pinnacle of the craft, man. I mean, sometimes huh? I care. Hey, look, guys, I'm gonna take off. All right. Well, just get, get out of here. here. Oh, Jim, boy, Joe, you gotta get a lock for that thing. Yeah, I'm gonna need your gym key. <laughs> <laughs> so, well. Anyway, this one's called the Juicy Lucy. It goes way back its origin. Just like <laughs> this should be good. <laughs> Ricky. All set? Sure. Same as last time? Oh, Same as last time. Uh, uh, gift right. You spit that with stuff. <laughs> there he is. Oh, my foot. Ooh, muffler. Top of the world, Ma. <laughs> Yesterday pizza, today butter, tomorrow the world. <laughs> huh? Huh? You there, drop that butter. Jeez it, it's the dairy police. Uh-oh, busted. You know, I think this is the same plot as Mortal Thugs. Or Killdozer. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, daddy is soon gonna be dead <laughs> You know. All right, pull it over, Flintstone, with the courtesy of your two feet. <laughs> uh, coming up on dead plot curve. <laughs> that burns my butter. Hey. hey wait a minute. This is how Liz Taylor bought it in Butterfield 8. I'm coming, Liz! Ooh. Watch out for that tree! He changed his shirt. <laughs> Looks like we've been double-crossed by this kid, Pete Plum. Oh, Oscar, Oscar, Oscar! We're Siegfried gonna have and Roy? A talk with Pete. If he can't get the stuff, he better still have our dough. Because we gotta make that pizza. Yeah, we're gonna get that junk we paid for or our dough back. But either way, I think this punk needs a little personal attention. Huh? Are you Pete Plum? He's being yeah, mugged by right. a Mennonite. What a talk Those to guys Pete. are crazy. What's your story, Jack? Get in the car, buddy. I'll blow your brains out. Yeah, snappy title. Uh, 
Phil has a problem. Down there. Man, dig that crazy John Williams groove, baby. We're going to kill you, but we got to stop at a cash machine first. Bedfloor, hardware. Hey, can you lay off the music? I'm kind of nervous. Tell Chan Woman to keep it down. Fourth floor, menswear. What? Hill Street Blues? Oh. Fifth floor, notions, ready to wear, child mingus. <laughs> Goodbye, pork pie hat. <laughs> okay, Pete. Where is it? Where is what? Your solar plexus. Where is it, Pete? I don't know what he you're talking your about. Your dad's a dwarf. Ooh. Hey, he called you a femme. Yeah, he did. He said your mother wears leather underwear. Just give us back the dough. You're a softy guy. I invested it in an IRA. Wait till I break your jaw, yeah. Wait till I break your jaw. <laughs> Oh, you missed a spot. Right, I hear Hi, how is everything going? Patty cake, patty cake, baker's man. Breaking your jaw as fast as we can. Anything new to tell me? <laughs> Rose blood was a slut. I'm not Pete Clump. Huh? Clump! Huh? What are you idiots doing? That isn't Pete Plum. That's Eve Plum. Oh. oh. Hey, look, it's Marilyn Monroe and the Misfits. I, to think. I don't like it. They weren't due for another My week. My head is too heavy. Captain hey, Bird. she caught her back fat in the doorway. She's trapped. Oh, no. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Had a good time. Can I call you? Honey, you're home. 101, 102... Oh, hi, honey. Just working out. Cigarette? Oh, just kidding. Brother. Bad gig. Ugh. Still on. Come on, get me out of sight. Out of mind. Oil can. Oil can. I think I know who killed Sonny. Well, let's call the police. Not yet. We need a third act in this movie. Can't let Chilla see me like this. Too ashamed. Come on, let's get out of here. Wait till I get you home, girl. Hmm? Hey, one of them shouldn't be in there. Hmm? It's him. Are you all right? Just hurts a little when I breathe. Well, don't breathe. <laughs> no, we gotta call the cops. I've got the answer. Hey, hey what? I don't oh. think so sure of anything. Never. Got this thing figured out, Janet. Yeah, you turn these little knobs and the water comes out. <laughs> Sonny met Chillis and Green at the gym. Will Chillis? They knew he needed money and they offered him a chance to make some fast. How? Amway. Delivering dope. So oh. that's what they've been doing. What do you think's in those cigarettes you're selling? You gave him a hopped up car. A phony driver's license. Anyway, some other dealer must have got to him. Offered him 5,000 bucks to double cross Chillis. Sonny banked the money in his mom's name. And? Go on. And then, uh, instead of delivering Chillis' next shipment, he hid it in his locker. And mm. Chillis found out and forced him off the road. Hey, hey, right. hey, hey, hey. My oh, pants got a little low, stuff. okay? Mm. Couldn't find it, but I tipped Green off when I went to the gym. Sonny's key. Well, who did this? The guy who paid his money Was sent out a couple of all of a sudden? see why he didn't get anything. They thought I was Sonny. What did they do to you? Come on, we gotta get to a phone. Chillis is probably out looking for me right now. He's in some kind of trouble. Uh -huh. What? Huh? Green brought him a message. He said something about Captain Perez getting here. Green uh -huh. is on its way. Oh. A boat. You got any aqua velva? That's how they get the stuff from Mexico. Where's your car? Outside. There's a uh -huh. boat in that gas station down the road. I hate those. Come on. 
Killers just came out. And the lighting's even worse. Oh, just heading out down to the freezer to get some fudge sickles. Yep. Headed for the beach. Hey, just throw her anywhere, Phil. I'm gonna tail it. You get to that phone. Oh, I'm going with you. Get out. Oh, dear God, I'm fat this time. My it's gosh. Orson Welles. We will sell no dope before it's time. Hey, we're, we're getting good at this, aren't we? In the fourth quatrain, Nostradamus predicted the end of this movie would result in bloodshed, the destruction of England, and a cigar for me, and a couple of magic tricks on Carson. Hey, do the bunny hop. Yeah. Trust your trip was a pleasant one, Captain Perez. Had a good time, it was fair enough. Yeah, it was fair. Not not quite delightful. Surprise. Yeah. surprise to an intelligent man like you, Sidney. Green Street. Do for another week. Come off it. You know we have newspapers in Mexico, too. Yeah, Pluto's been talking I'll about I'll make you. it up. We'll get every cent. Of course we will. It won't happen again. You have my assurance. Well, it better not, Scott. I'll have the to buy you one. Is, your assurance is something <laughs> in which we no longer can depend. You're wrong. I've been with the organ. When you turn over the money, our business association will be terminated. That's right. Yeah. But, uh, I haven't collected yet. Then I'll wait offshore till dawn. No Underwater scheme. We know an old time. Yeah. You know the organization better than to ask that. If obsession is a crime, then declare me guilty. I've known you for ten years. We've, mm, don't touch me there. Don't We've been through Lamaze together. Son, it would make any difference. All right, you two. Yeah. I've got a gun on you. It's all set. Now listen carefully. Our lives depend on this. You, my suspicious friend, are going to pick up some money for me. Bruce will accompany you on the to piano. make sure of a successful and hasty return. You, my dear. You'll remain here with me. That should be a little added incentive for Philip. It's now 11.30. The entire trip won't take more than 45 minutes. But if for some reason you're not back within an hour... The first runner-up will take your place. An accident will happen to the young lady here. She'll we'll go brunette. One more thing. I don't like it, but I've killed before. Oh. I assure you, return with the money. You'll both be released. This... Bites. Slow down. Pull up by the mailbox. I gotta send a Mother's Day card. <laughs> Earn this on my paper route. <laughs> Save it for a bike. Turn right. Huh? I know it's left. I said right, right boy. Look, if we're not back to that club in 20 minutes, that girl's gonna die. What's the difference? It'd kill you both anyway. Well, then. Um... Left it is, right, Pull up over here. Now open your door and get out. You can't drive without me. I don't have far to go. Look. You can't I'll look. Take you. Anything you want to do, just let me get back to that girl, huh? Outside. Outside. Huh? We'll probably get huh? those back in about an hour. Oh, yeah. Shooting at rocks. Speaker, no! <laughs> Whoa, he's working the heavy bag. Check it out. <laughs> Connected that time, fella. <laughs> this is what Jar Jar did to that cop. Ooh. Now, just gonna check your eyes. Better one, better two. Now the left eye. Now it's dangling by a cord. That should be good. I can mm. see. I can see. It's amazing. Hmm. Oh! That guy's a good tipper. Yeah. Meanwhile, back at the Copa, the Viv's in a lot of trouble. He'll make it. Meanwhile, our hero stopped at the Stuckies to get a salted nut roll. Oh, I love those. Hey, having a microwave is very convenient. Ooh, hot danger. Ouch. It's a stupid guy who's coming to the penitentiary. And I gotta call my agent. Get me out of this film. Uh, hello, Broadway Danny Rose. Hello, operator. 
Give me the police right away, please. No, the real police. Okay, I'm gonna get. Wait. Oh, should I put my tape player in my trunk? I don't know if they. Oh, forget it. You're late. Where's Jan? Where's the money? Where have all the flowers gone? Green tried to pull a double cross. It was gonna kill me. The money must have dropped out when we fought. You don't expect me to believe it. Help! <laughs> She's groaning. Hmm. She's in there, isn't she? Philip! I want that money. Oh, you rotten slob! He shot the king! Oh, oh, money or I'll kill you. <laughs> oh, that's weak. Oh, my head! Where did I park? There must be a minotaur somewhere in this labyrinth. Yeah. Oh, that helps. Oh. Hey, it's Charles Durning. Now I want everyone to jump out and yell surprise when he comes down okay, here. Okay, I agree. There he comes. Okay. Ready? Oh. Ooh, he shot old Forrester. Wait, how'd he get back here so fast? Oh, he's got a spare Pearl Vision at a two-for-one sale. Barbie at the spa. Help! She's crisping. Boss? Who? Debbie Harry, tough gig. Where's Gillis? Yes, I don't know. I have to fill, I think. Did he get the money? I could hardly hear. I think he lost it fighting with you. He lost it fighting with you. Oh. I need you. Oh, please don't complicate my life right now. Hey, Midas Eyes, what are you running an Evan route under that hood? I would like a snack, something light and chocolatey. Step on it. This buggy can take anything on the road. Except Jack Kerouac. It's a car we missed in that oh, narcotics. Oh, it's the milkman. Reed Fleming, world's toughest. You can't catch it. Can't touch this. Roadblock south of Wilson Avenue, turn off. I Repeat. think he's one of the dead in the Hey, who's talking? Wilson Avenue, turn off. Other turn offs, guys who spit, fat butts, and sweats. Here in the wine cellars of Ernest and Julio Gallo. Uh, this is just like when you're shopping and you see somebody you don't like. All right, yeah. right. Hi. Oh, oh right in the Chablis. I think they're in an Etruscan tomb. Did you dust down here? No, you've beaten the first challenge. Time to move to level two. Oh. This is no time to practice juggling. Ooh. Boy, that wasn't wine, that was a caliber. Get it? <laughs> Boom. Oh, red wine does not go with my lips. Oh, right in a schnoz. Clown parade all of a sudden. I christened this scene bad. This is my secret fort. Nobody can find me up here. I can head up here and read my magazines and everything. Oh, come oh, on. You can't so see obvious. him up there. Oh, for Give me a break. Wait a minute. Huh? Oh. This is all coming out of your paycheck. Oh, he did his own stunts. Hey, Here's Sinatra. Roadblock. Hi, Mr. Roadblock. I'm sure I'll blow your brains out. Look out. Ooh. He's coming through. I don't care. And that was the incredible action sequence mm. for Daddy-O. Well, time for your EPA test. Mm -hmm. uh, I love riding in the DeSoto. All right, everybody inside for the wrap-up. Sid Field and the plot, police. Da -da -da -da. Who's Phil? I don't know. Chillis was after him. Somebody looking for me? <gasps> hey. Oh, give me a warm fuzzy, you big galoot. Where's Chillis? He's in the basement. I'm afraid he's had too much to drink. <laughs> <laughs> what about Prez? He's gigging with Lady Day. I suppose you realize you violated your probation. Well, look, mm -hmm. I'm sorry, Mr. Wooster. There was no other way. I'll put you in solitary. You do? And she goes with me. Well, then it's not solitary. Uh -uh. You're welcome to her. According to her, you should be chief of police. Uh, 
now, who ever heard of a chief of police without a driver's license? Oh, oh no, uh, you don't. Don't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> the hat right, off. Kids, <laughs> Are you going to sing a song, Daddy O? Well, he doesn't feel like singing. Are you kidding? I've never felt more like singing in my life. And we've never felt less like hearing you. That's cool. Oh, I hear you. Ah! I want an answer. Want some? I want an answer. Want some? I want an answer. Oh, wow, you know, no matter how many times I see that thing, I always learn something new. Okay, I'm ready, Crow. Let's try it. Hey, Joel. Want some? I want an answer. That worked pretty good. Okay, Tom, ready? Let's try it. Well, you know, I can't uh, use my hands to hold an apple, so I rigged up this Carmen Miranda getup. What do you think? You can't hold an apple, but you... Oh, forget it. Okay. All right. Some guys had brothers. I had Sonny. Okay. Oh. Um, oh. Uh, uh, so you killed Sonny. Admit it. Ah! Oh. Whoa. Oh. Okay. Uh, your name's Peter uh, get Plum. your clothes on. You're coming with me. Ah! Oh. 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 Uh, your name's my Peter name Plum. is Peter Plump. Ah. Oh. Mm. Oh. Oh. If you weren't a guy, oh. well, I'd bust okay. you in the chops. If you weren't a guy, I'd bust you in the okay. chops. Okay. Ah. Okay. Okay. Ah. okay. Joel. 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 Cam the Stanislavski. This is Chris Payne. Cam the Stanislavski. Okay. Let's read some letters for All crying right. out loud. I'm sorry. I got kind of crazy Whoa. there. Okay, let's do that. Um, let's see. Let's put this up on still store Canva. Right. Okay, this Great one book. is from Christina's, and right. this is kind of a. I am seven years old. I am in the first grade, sister. Oh, she's sister. Hood is powerful. Ooh, okay, really it says, "Shut up, you guys." And Tom Servo says, "I hate you too." And Crow says, "I hate you." That's really oh, sweet. Okay, no, now this yeah, one comes from <laughs> the Xerox Full Integration Test Engineers. Let's cool. put that on Still mm. Store, and that says. Dear Joel Cambot, Tom Servo, Crow, and Gypsy, we, the Xerox Full Integration Test Engineers, do solemnly swear to be faithful MST3K viewers until death, unreasonably high taxes, or show cancellation do uh -huh. us part. I wow. think that's full integration test humor. I think so. Doing. Anyway, we have a fun, large group of people here at Xerox that are addicted to your incredibly funny show. We have a ritual now that Friday lunches are reserved strictly for MST3K viewing. Life here at Xerox has been enhanced by MST3K, and frankly, we feel that it would be virtually impossible to live without the satellite of love. Keep up the good work, people and bots. Okay, this is the last one. This one is, uh, we'll put that on still store there. And this says, Dear guys, I have always liked your show since the begin. I'm writing yeah. to you guys to ask a few questions. One, how long did it take to build Tom Servo, Crow, and Gypsy after you had the design? Built? Two. How do guys do before and after the experiments? Every week. It's an intelligent and question. What do guys do to relax? Questions, what? questions, questions. I oh. need answers, answers, oh, oh, answers. Oh, oh, oh. Ah, ah. Don't, 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 don't. Wait till I get you home, baby. <laughs> uh, what do you think, sirs? Hmm? Push the button, Frank. Want some? Push the button, Frank. No, really, I insist. Push the button. Have one. Push the button, Frank. You're not getting enough to eat. Push the button, Frank. Oh, have some. Push the button. Want some? Yeah. Yeah. Push the button, Frank. <laughs> What the Sam Scratch is going on here? He's playing with the buttons. Oh. Isn't that cute? <laughs> here, here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Push the button, Frank. It's a good boy. Come on. There you go. Uh, oh, he's lucky. Uh, It's on. I think so. Push the button, Frank.
Uh, Dr. Forrester, <laughs> it's not working. Not working. Well, no wonder. Your baby's got string carrots all over the keyboard. Uh, you're just going to have to hold the key down, Frank. I've got to go change him. But he's going to want to change. Just hold the button down, Frank. <laughs> Got the problem. I'm only paying you half price for that because it took you over 30 days to burrow here with that pizza. Frank! Frank? Hmm? What are you doing? I was just getting a piece of water. A piece of water? I mean, a glass of cake. Come here. I mean, uh, Come here. I mean, Come here. Let me show you something. I mean, I mean, <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. Well, that's it, Frank. We're licked. Dr. Forrester, I've known you to be many things before, but I've never known you to be a quitter. Are you going to give up now? Don't quit. Live, damn it, live! Oh, I remember. Alt function seven. Couldn't help you if I wanted to, fella. Gen policy.